Here's something about Israel that just made my heart sing. This is out of Israel today. It says, Israeli government official in solidarity with vandalized church. If you're not familiar, uh, a Christian church, the Baptist house, was vandalized here a couple of days ago. Uh, but check this out. Local Christian leaders and an Israeli government representative gathered at the Baptist House Church in central Jer Jerusalem today, one day after the building was vandalized with anti-Christian graffiti. This meeting could be best described as a demonstration of solidarity by the State of Israel with the Christian community. <laughs> but it was also somewhat of a celebration of the strong friendship that exists between Israel and Christians, as well as a call for Christians to respond to such attack with even more love for Israel. Chuck Kopp, pastor of the local Baptist congregation, started the event by suggesting that while the attack was unfortunate and hurtful, the response by Israelis has had a far bigger impact. It just makes me <laughs> so happy. Um, <clears throat> uh, Anyway, uh, this says the rabbi and cantor from the synagogue across the street came the same day as the vandalism with a huge bouquet of flowers and a, a note of solidarity and friendship. Another Israeli lady came in with flowers and when I asked if she was also a neighbor, she said no, she was just a concerned Israeli citizen. There's been a huge outpouring of solidarity and friendship from the Israelis. <clears throat> um, Herbie Gear, the official Southern Baptist Convention representative in Israel, said, You have extremists everywhere, but Israel has consistently stood with its minorities, referencing the French price tag gangs that are believed to have been behind the attack. Gear said, We know there is a price tag for standing for what we believe, and we know that m most Israelis want us to be who we are. And then Dr. Moti Zakin uh, special advisor to Israeli, Israel's Minister of Internal Security on Minority Affairs stated, I apologize on behalf of Israel. You have the solidarity and the support of the overwhelming majority of Israelis who view such attacks with disgust. We will bring those responsible to justice, but more importantly, you must know that the majority of Israelis reject such actions. Nobody deserves to be vandalized like this, but especially not our special and supportive Christian friends. Mm -mm -mm. 